If you forgot your password to sign into your Windows computer, then this video is just for you. In this video, we'll see how to reset the password of a Windows PC without having any administrative access and without losing any of your files. We'll be using a software named PassFab for WinKey, who are also the sponsors of this video. This is a great software to remove or reset your Windows account password, or even add or delete your existing Windows accounts from your computer without having any administrative access. Also, this is a paid software. And if you're thinking why you should use a paid software to reset a Windows PC, the reason is this software works in almost all scenarios and it is very easy to use. One more thing, this is safe. You will not end up corrupting your computer or losing any of your files. However, I'm giving away some premium serial keys for the software. So if you want to get one of these, watch the video until the end. The instructions will be mentioned at the end of this video. So let's get started. The first step is to download 4WinKey. I will put the link in the description below. Once downloaded, simply install the software and open it once installed. Here you can choose either to use a CD or DVD or a USB flash drive to burn the Windows boot disk. Since I have a USB with me, I'll choose USB and select my USB drive from the drop down menu. Please be advised that all your files on your USB flash drive will be erased if you continue. So make a backup of your USB drive files if you need them. Click on next and wait for the burning process to finish. Once it's done, you will see an instructions guide like this. You can make a note of the boot keys for different computers. You will need this boot key in order to open the BIOS menu and then change your boot device. You can now plug out your USB and plug it into the computer which you want to recover and then turn your computer on. As soon as you turn on the computer, keep spamming the boot key on your keyboard. In my case, it is F12. Now you can see the BIOS menu. From here, you can change your boot device such that your computer boots from the USB drive that you inserted. Now these settings may actually vary for you depending on the computer model that you're using, but keep looking and you will definitely find them. If you need help finding your boot device settings, you can always try Googling it along with your computer's model. For me, it's pretty straightforward. I'll just go to Boot Manager and select USB from the list of available disks. And now the computer boots from the USB drive. You need to wait some time until Windows finishes loading files. Once it's done, you will see the interface of 4WinKey like this. Here, select the Windows system that you want to recover and click Next. Now you will see all the accounts that are available on your Windows operating system. You need to choose an account whose password you want to change or remove. You can also remove an existing Windows account or add a new Windows account using this software. I want to reset the password of this account named Tejaswaroop. As you can see, this is a Microsoft account and also an administrator. I'll just select the account and then select reset the password and click next. Now it prompts you to enter your registration code or in other words, your serial key. Once you entered yours, the activation will be processed and you need to click on next again. Here it prompts you to enter the new password that you want to set to the account. I'll enter a simple password, one, two, three and then click reset. Once the password is resetted, you need to reboot your computer. And this time, you can normally boot to your Windows operating system. And there you go. It says that your password is successfully resetted. Let's try it. I'll type the password 123 and there you go. I now got back my access into my computer. So, time for the serial key giveaway. If you want a premium serial key for this software, find the Google Forms link in the description and then fill in your name and email ID there. The first few people to fill the form will receive the serial key on their email. So thanks for watching, hope you liked this video and if you are not a subscriber yet to my channel, please hit the subscribe button and also turn on the bell icon to receive instant updates from my channel. I'll see you in the next video, until then, cheers!